drink for everyone. Lion's mane in a cup for everyone. Lion's mane on a stick for everyone. Lion's mane is chalk ice for everyone. Lion's mane, it's ice cream time with Lion's mane. Down Under to a place where Down Under is the very thing they try to avoid. Members of the British Canoe Union have to keep their heads up above water. For this is a canoe slalom, an obstacle race on rough water. Slalom is a Norwegian word meaning a race between obstacles. The competitor will prove his watermanship by passing through the obstacle gates without bumping the poles, which force him to zigzag across the white boil of broken water and up and down the stream. His canoe is protected by a spray cover tied to his waist and pulled taut over all the open part of the boat. The danger of a capsize is always present, so each of the competitors is usually a strong swimmer. try to learn the Eskimo roll, which brings the canoe through a complete turn. But in case of a bump on the head underwater, competitors wear life jackets. In today's event, all the canoes used are of the kayak type, homemade of ash wood and in one instance with an aluminium frame. By international rules, the canoes have to be collapsible. The gates and turns in the slalom represent all the hazards and tests of watermanship that a canoeist may expect when touring a rapid river. Although British exponents are handicapped by lack of natural conditions, canoe slalom in Britain is increasing rapidly in popularity. The sport, started on the continent 20 years ago, is best served by swirling glacier-fed rivers. Exciting and safe for the experts when properly organized, rough water canoeing calls for skill and nerve. British exponents may soon be using that skill to win international honors at Canoe Slalom. <laughs> 